viewers so welcome to mojo for industry we are at uh, automation expo 2024 and now we, we are at the stall of autonics automation india and i'll be talking to mr uh, umes and he's the national sales manager for autonics automation india so uh, mr umes if you can just uh, briefly tell us about what autonics does and what kind of business presence you have as of now uh, autonics is basically a south korean uh, company based out of uh, busan and uh, equally we are uh, have a global presence across the globe uh, autonics is quite uh, well known for sensors and controllers other product category like uh, thyristor controllers uh, then uh, expanding our sensor product uh, baskets uh, then equally uh, coming up with a safety product lineup so then uh, increasing our uh, existing portfolio uh, like uh, switches sockets uh, which we have been serving our customers since last more than uh, 14 15 years in india uh, at this particular no it is an of uh, automation expo we can see that you are hosting a range of products so what what are your key focus area for this expo while uh, take an opportunity to uh, introduce our new product lineup basically uh, here we can see uh, we have an uh, ultrasonic sensor okay so this is an addition to our existing uh, sensor por- portfolio which was not there earlier but right now we have come up uh, with this ultrasonic product range then uh, we all also launched our upgraded version of new power supply series spb-8 so this is uh, primarily used in in any of the panel builder if i say from the mass uh, user point of view second there are uh, cnc uh, manufacturers uh, in india like bangalore rajkot those areas and those need a very specific feature of holding time which is equally supported by this uh, product up okay. the other user could be like uh, fmcg uh, players oem manufacturers and equally the end users part of it it supports uh, rather it works gives a features like over current protection over voltage and over temperature which i said 70 degree right so that is in terms of the feature part if i talk about from the competitiveness of it so we have a benchmark with our international competitors which is equally a price competitive product so in my opinion so that could be an edge which can help us to leverage in terms of the volume of this product in india right to our users uh this is uh, basically a spatter proof sensor which is mainly used in the automotive or welding section welding robot fixtures for the body parts of cars scooters two wheelers three wheelers and those spatters which gets deposited on the sensor earlier we were having only two wire right now we are having three wire which is equally the customers require three wires spatter proof sensors Right. So these are the products uh, which we have launched uh, this year. Then, uh, this is a very specific, unique uh, buzzer. The beauty of this buzzer is you can program the tune or any specific words or sound which you want to hear repeatedly, so that you can insert into this buzzer and that gets as and when you recall it. So that's the beauty of it. Uh, what? So as you have been hearing out. Uh, the artificial intelligence industry 4.0 and then in iot mm. so to support those kind of a product uh, we have equally launched uh, an uh, iolink sensors so which uh, can be used uh, in most of the automotive end users so those line up we are coming up then we are also coming up with actuator sensor interface device Uh, which has a communication network and as well as it supports io link communication another thing which uh, i won't say uh, related to iot industry but one of the upcoming industry trend i would say so this is uh, primarily coming up uh, with the upcoming requirement uh, in logistic material handling industry for an uh, automation purpose and uh, we are seeing modes of uh, mobile robots then automatic guided vehicles right. then autonomous mobile robots which are coming up in most of the warehouse automation requirements and uh, this is the product 
which can support these mobile robots so which can help them to detect an obstacle which is coming in line with the AGV or uh, for a mobile robot which can harmful for the AGV or the human intervention so that can be avoided when act give a indication to the system and the system can then accordingly take a respective actions here i would like to uh, pinpoint something uh, we have a very unique solution for a temperature controller measurement okay uh, which can be used in any uh, pharma packaging solutions so wherein uh, they need to monitor uh, the ceiling temperature of the film for the packaging so there uh, some customers need a unique uh, requirements of the ceiling temperatures or in case the system gets stopped on any of the reason either there is a power cut or any shutdown the system should restart they start from the same position those kind of specific requirements we have also adopted as a customer specific or industry specific requirement and accordingly we have modified our product also right to suit indian customer requirement it could be customer specific or industry specific so we are adjusting ourselves for the user requirement play right. so he will uh, now have the in- important portfolio app now having heading the national sales so right uh, how do you see the growth in the you know in the years to come and what sort of objectives you are setting a target for uh, uh, mix automation in india okay. so here i would say since last 3 uh, years if i uh, talk about uh, the business part of it we have almost uh, doubled our growth in, in terms of the sales revenue part of it thank you so much say great talking to you so we was here is a company korean company autonix so no uh, already strengthened their footprint in indian market with the uh, the uh, desired growth what they were targeting at the same time getting ready to make in india whenever the situation permits and whenever the requirement comes Absolutely. thank you so much hello friends if you enjoyed watching this video please like comment share and subscribe to our channel for more awesome content